it was a long journey uh, from, from London, but we always knew it was going to be a long journey. Uh, I stopped off in Doha and then Seoul, jumped in a train over here. Uh, it, was, it was fun. I know my, my, my travel procedures, my stretching on the flight and all that, and hydration. So it was cool. Jet lag hasn't been too bad. I, I made sure I stayed up late my first night. So I've kind of half got into the routine. You know, my body feels okay. Uh, the setup here is fantastic. The organization is exemplary, I have to say. The facilities look fantastic and feels great. I did a bit of a run out today and yesterday. Uh, and I feel it's, you know, they've prepared very well for us. So yeah, we're really, really, really looking forward to it. Nerves, mm, not really. A bit of adrenaline, very, very mild because your body knows that something's about to happen soon. Uh, yeah, mm, I say yes, you get a bit nervous, but it's normal. And you need that, you know, it's that slight fear factor um, ahead of a championship. You know, you want to perform, you really want to represent and do yourself and everybody else proud. So of course, you're going to be slightly on edge, but I'm used to that. I know how to, how to deal with that. Um, just stay relaxed, stay hydrated, and just trust myself that, you know, when, when, when the time is, is here, that I will, I will do what I need to do. Um, and that's really it, the two days to go. Uh, I'm excited, I'm relaxed, my body feels awesome. I know I'm ready to go. Yeah, what, what I would say I've experienced, from the Korean people since I've been here. It's been very positive. Um, they've made me feel really welcome here. Uh, everyone's, yeah, as you can imagine, the language barriers is, can be an issue, but they've been really, really uh, positive coming forward to help, to assist, you know, at a tube station or at the airport, with, with anything, everyone's ready to help. Um, you know, I've been hanging out with one of my friends, David Boomer, my French compatriot, and, um, i a great host at his apartment. We've, we've had some fun cooking and just, just catching up ahead of the championship. She competes as well on the same day as myself. And, uh, and the music has been very loud, very exciting. They're, they're letting us know beyond any doubt that there is an event about to take place here. Did you, you were stuck. You know, everybody wants a picture. Fantastic, I don't mind. Um, I feel like a superstar here. So, yeah, it makes it good. Wow. Ready to rumble, ready to, let's get it on. Just want to say a big thank you to all the guys that back home sending me lots of messages saying good luck and all that. It means a lot and yeah, it does help when, when I'm on the starting line to know that I have a huge support back home. So hopefully I can represent and, and deliver for myself and for all you guys as well. So keep the love coming. Can, you know, there'll be a live stream I'll be posting up on my Facebook page later today. So please watch if you can. Uh, there'll be lots of videos coming up showing the races and how I'm progressing. So please follow me on, on all the social media fronts, TJ Osai, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, you know, it's there for you guys to follow my progress. Thank you again. Oh, and you can follow my journey to Daegu and just my general progress and a mini documentary coming out, uh, I believe on the 26th of April, which is not just about me, but about you know, Masters Athletics also, just to inspire everybody towards their goals, you know, just so you can see my journey and how I've achieved what I've achieved, and you can as well. <laughs>